I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator. I live and work in Scotland and I've just come in. Hello everyone, I just give me a moment because I'm not set up so that I can see your comments properly. <sighs> Forgot to switch the old iPad on so that I can see your comments. To give it a wee white polish actually. So <clears throat> let's just get this. Come on. Hope you're all okay. The fire's on. And Cindy's here, she might make you a coffee. I'll just get the space to put this up so that we'll be able to chat with you. Give it a minute. It's showing I'm here. Mute it. Right. I think I'm here. Oh, it's been silly. Let's just... Right, we have to change this. The power needs to go here, not there. Right, sorry folks. Maybe not the best idea to come live when you're supposed to be getting ready for bed. Hey Karen, <laughs> oh, don't you? Yeah. I came through, I came through to get it ready for bed and then what do I do? I start this idea for a card. Anyway, let me say hello to who's in. Hi Cindy, you're sharp today. It's because I'm late, I don't normally come on the Saturday night, it's just a wee bonus. Hi Randy. Hi Alison. Karen, hiya. Ladonia, hiya. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. So the fire is still on. I haven't blown it out yet. So you should be able to um, get cosy and get a wee. Well, if you're in the UK, you can have a wee nightcap. If you're elsewhere, well, you'll have to decide what's appropriate. Right. So. Got this. Remember a few weeks ago we were playing. Hi Nessa, and you come. Remember a few weeks ago was playing about with um, ink refills and did various things. So I've still got these to use, but um, I've got this as well. And this was in my mind to use that. Wait till I just have a wee check here as well. Yeah, right. So I think I'm going to try and. I've got this idea for a card and then I realise I'll actually might make two cards this idea. Hi Christine. Oh Christine, those big cards you made, they are so cute. And I just wasn't going to buy the, I was going to try and resist the kangaroo set. Hi Karen, and you come. But because I've got grandchildren in Australia and then I saw your card and I thought, you know, I might have to order that after all. Right, so I'm going to use this, the largest of the rectangles and the stitch rectangles oh you've got a warm sunny sunday there sylvia well lucky you hi karen and you come so we've two karens in the house tonight so far so get a wee seat by the fire sylvia you won't really want to sit by the fire i shouldn't think but it's lovely to have you anyway for as long as you can <laughs> I'm going to bring my big shot in. As I say, this is one of those things that's an idea in my head. It might not work, but we'll give it a go. Karen, uh, there's two Karens, but Cory Paper Crafts is also called Karen. <coughs> oh, a wee bit of a tickle tonight in my throat, so I'm hoping it's nothing sinister. I don't think it is. Right. I actually think the house got too warm. Too much heating. Oh, those ones were from the Zoo Globe, right? Yeah, I, yeah, I think I probably will go for the ones with the kangaroos. 
Right, so I'm just cutting this through to cut out that shape. I could have all cut it beforehand, but then I just wanted to chat with you guys, really. Because sometimes I miss it all. So see, that is going on just onto a plain white card. But I want to, because I'm thinking that might do... I might get two cards out of this. I'm going to cut another of these rectangles in basic white. Hi Carolyn, you come. I've just cut this out well. As I say, do you know sometimes these ideas that you have in your head work and sometimes they don't. But seeing as you're all my pals, I don't think you'll mind. And if it goes wrong, we'll just delete it afterwards. And we'll just have had a wee secret rendezvous. Yeah, I wish, kind of wish I was in South Australia right now. I'm sure you're a little bit warmer than we've been. Although, to be fair, it's been a bit mild, but then... When we get it mild, we get it wet, so in the winter. Right, so that's the two rectangles that I need. I'm keeping this out because I want to cut. This is from, I kept it out here to show you, from Dandy Wishes die set. Oops, it's a bit slipped. Are you glad I came on? How kind. I just, yeah, I'm just trying to put this die set. I'll show you the rest of them later, but I want to get this monster machine. Although, do you know, it isn't a monster machine. It's pretty good, this one. I like my wee, the wee baby one, though. Right, so I'm just popping. I don't know how much you can see. I'm trying to keep it where you can see as much. I'm putting that there, and I'm going to cut the flower out. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be able to get the whole flower but I'm just going to cut it about there. There'll be a bit at the bottom there. So as I say this might be horrible. Once I've cut this that's all the die cutting we need. I'll show you the whole set in a minute. Right, so I'm just going to pop this out. Come on, just come out. I mean, that was just one pass through the machine and that has cut out so well. So it's basically two simple cards I've got in mind. I'm basically just going to pop that on there. I'm going to glue it. Well, that's the theory. Had a bit of a glue day today. Some people don't like the dyes because one of them's like a dandelion. And I think it's lovely. People are going, oh, they're just weeds, but you know, weeds are just beautiful flowers growing somewhere that you don't want them to grow. That's all. And dandelions are so good for the bees and the butterflies. Right, so I've just kind of just want to put a bit, see the these bits here, so they don't lift. Turn this a wee bit so it's not so squint. Hi Sophia. Hi Suzanne. I know it's late, it's late, late Saturday night. Late. Ooh. Please go straight. Please, please, please go straight for me. Because I don't have a whole lot of glue on. 
think that was straight enough. Hi Kerry. See it's funny when you come in at a different time to usual, you see different people, it's nice. Okay. Right, so I'm thinking then I'll make some kind of sentiment on here. I've actually got another wee idea going on in the wee head here. And then I need another white card base. Where's my bag of card bases? I think I've got another basic white one hiding here. I say this might not be a long get together. So get a seat by the fire folks and there's drinks and nibbles on the table so just help yourself. And then I'm just going to stick this on here and we'll have a sentiment and that basically just simple, simple dimples. I, d I like this. I just think it's ever so pretty. I need just a dot of glue here because it's annoying me. Did you see it annoying me? Come on, glue, play the game. That's it. So I was freezing earlier on, put the heating on and now it's too, too cold, hot. And I think that's why I'm a bit sniffly. I've turned the heating off. Right, so that's that and I need to think about the sentiment. I'm thinking just a wee happy birthday will be nice. And I know where we've got a nice happy birthday. Have you seen the happy birthday on sweet ice cream? That is gorgeous. The, I didn't make this at the beginning, Kerry. This is another video. It's from a few weeks ago. It's called Play... Uh, uh, I think it was Making Inky Backgrounds it was called. But what I probably do is put the link to it into the description box below this. Oh, you've got a glass of wine there, Christine. I'm glad to hear it. Just you make yourself comfortable while I try and get this glue to cooperate with me because I just want a little bit, just some dots up the stem and then maybe just a wee dot. Well, no, I'm thinking they would be quite nice if they're not all fixed down. We'll see. Some are fixed down. Right. So it's like two cards for the price of one. I'm going to leave that for a second and pop this onto the white card base. I did consider putting this one onto a gorgeous grape base, but I think I'm just wanting to keep it simple and just put it on to the basic white base. Got a wee bit of icky glue on there. Let's put this flat. Yeah, that, I, I, when I was dropping the ink from the re and so I've still not used up everything, so I kind of thought I was needing to use them. I've had this idea for this this die, ooh, this die for a while and I thought what inky background have I got that would work with this. Yeah these were ones, hi Ruth and you come, yeah that, these were made a few weeks ago these backgrounds Ruth and so I promised the ladies I would keep coming in and showing them what I do with them. So I'm supposed to be going to bed and I got this wee idea. Now I need, obviously need um, sentiments for them and I'm, there's a couple of ideas going on in my head here. But um, 
The sweet ice cream has got an amazing sentiment here, the happy birthday and a thank you one. So I think, I think I'm going to just finish off very simply. I will, or this one I'll just get one stamped on sentiment and then we'll do one. I think we'll emboss a sentiment for that one. I'll try simple ink, if not I'll have to make one. Still quite warm. Guys, I'm just going to open the window. It's too hot. So, I want to do the thank you. Because it'll make a nice wee thank you note card. Try. Why do I have to get a a sticky bit in a hair, spoil it. Yeah, that, well, I thought that. I could have sat here on my own and played or come in and share. As I say, if it goes wrong, we'll just delete it afterwards. Right, I'm just going to try for this one to just simply And I'm thinking about this one, I'm thinking about using a bit of that and embossing the sentiment in white. Hi Shirley, hi Joanna, and anyone else who's popped in and I haven't noticed you. Hello, you're welcome. The fire's on if you're feeling chilly. I think we'll just open this one out so it doesn't do pingy up. When you're doing cards like this, you really have to be careful with your hands. Now, I, I've just, do you know why I'm just about to do it and then I had another idea? Who else has that happened to? So, one of the other colours that was in here was rich raspberry. And I did this on a sentiment on a card just the other day, where it just dipped it in the darker colour. And then... The bottom and the other colour. And I'll just pick up some of the colours that are in this. Got a shake from somewhere tonight. I don't know where that is coming from. That's all right, isn't it? I, I know I was trying to go for simple, but my head's not simple. So I'm looking for my little wee punch, and I had it earlier on. You know, it's right beside me. So there is this little bit left over, and of course we have this little teetsy wee dragonfly punch so let's make the most So none of this was, this bit wasn't in my head when I started, it just came just now. I'm going to close the sink for the moment. That's quite good, isn't it? Not bad for someone who's supposed to be going to bed. I'm so tired she could hardly get herself off the couch a wee while ago. Just 
tweak the wings a wee bit just to give them a bit of some kind of shape to them. Do you all like dragonflies? So these are the punch and the as part of the whole. Oh, I got the book here. Yeah, it's all all part of this uh, glorious garden suite. So the dragonfly punch is the garden wishes. No, it's not. It's the dragonfly garden bundle. And I've been filming with that today because my February class in the post was based around that. So it's all ready to go out. So yeah, that's a lovely sweet. Yeah. No idea where I'm going to pop these, just around and about, I think. Are they not Sylvia? Oh, I love them. Love them. <laughs> Wouldn't do we all like the same things though? So I'm just popping a wee bit of glue or not popping a wee bit of glue. Here we go. I could watch ladybirds, ladybirds, that's flies, dragonflies. I like ladybirds too, but dragonflies hovering about damsel flies love them watch them for hours <laughs> but they're not weeds sorry they're not weeds they're wildflowers I find tweezers handy just for making sure the glue's made contact where you want it to. So I'm letting their wings free. And a bit of bling maybe. Should have some just the tiny little these little ones. Making myself use bling because you can hardly close this, it's bursting. So we need to use it. Just pop one on each. Yeah, they do eat the, the things that bite. So there's one. This was really the sec This is really the extra card because this is the one I had in my head. And to be honest, I like this one better so far. So I need. We need to do a sentiment for this one, and then I think what we'll do is we'll have some white dragonflies. Or yeah. So I think I would like to do a thing. Happy birthday. It's going to be quite big, isn't it? But we'll do it across. So, seeing as I've messed up this card base with glue, I think I'll use some of it. And we'll, I think I'll white emboss. If I can find my embossing things right. Pray that I put them where, away where they're supposed to be and then they'll be easy to find. Oh, it's looking promising. An embossing buddy. Heat and stick powder, that won't do. Clear stamp, it's always going to be the last one, isn't it? Because look, you can't hardly tell apart heat and stick, clear, white. Right, you have to read. I 
and I think this needs some white splat on it as well but let's let's sort out a uh, sentiment first let's chop this down my little chopper Yes, they, they're enormous at Flanders Moss. Oh my gosh, Shirley, they're huge, aren't they? It would make a nice sympathy card too. You're quite right. Right, where is the... the right, come on, I took it out and then I don't know what I did with it. Where did I put the happy birthday? <laughs> Maybe we won't be doing happy, but oh, it's there, it's on the card. <laughs> oh, oh, it's definitely bedtime. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I'm glad somebody's watching, Suzanne. <laughs> Just wiping that off with my cloth. I do have my chamois over there, but for some reason I've decided. Right, so I want to I want to stamp happy birthday, but I want to white heat emboss it. So let's just use my emboss buddy. Joe, one of the groups that I'm in today. <coughs> in the pinkies Michelle was saying describe your hobby badly and I put something along the lines of I film myself losing things and making mistakes and for some reason people keep asking for more <laughs> so it's like I'm blaming it all on you guys where's the mark First mark on my happy birthday. There we go. Well, that is kind of how it goes, is it not? I lose things and then and then I make mistakes and <laughs> you guys keep coming back <laughs> right okay so now we've definitely got white nice pop it back lid on before it is right I'm going to pop my heat tool on so just turn your sound down if this might bother you Just heating it up a bit. See, it goes a brighter white. want to waste all these beautiful backgrounds that we made but we made a lot that day so I didn't get using them up all that week I had to do other things and where's 
use my squeezers, my snips. I'm just gonna just cut that at an angle, and then the same here. It's just like cutting a wee wedge. It's just, it's not doing it for me really. So let me think, um, I think this needs some white splatters on it. So I have got a, where are you? I really do have an, a re-inker for the white. Until you need them, they sit in the same place. That's not fair. Somebody stole my re-inker. I've got two of them on the go. The other day, didn't I? They sit in the box in my drawer 364 days of the year. Obviously, not today. No, well, that's not going to work. How else can I have white splatter then? What about. now. This is one of the downsides. Oh here it is. Look, oh, no it's not. That's glue. This is one of the downsides of doing live. <laughs> Can't switch off and look for the thing that you've lost. Mm. Right so I could do something else I suppose. I don't know if this would work. I wonder if I could just get a brush and splatter. Yeah, um, that's why I've got shimmer paint. I'm just going to maybe do a bit of splats with this. Let's have a think. Um, let's just put a wee bit on here. I've got an old toothbrush. We could try that. Yeah, that, that's what I was going to do, but I can't find my white re-inker, Christine. That's... More or less what I was going to do. And I've got far too much in that there now. Mm. This will either work or not work. It's got two choices. <laughs> I, my white ink pad is just about doesn't. I only add a wee bit of time to it. Let's just see what happens. Let's just look at the big splatter I've got where I didn't want it, but that will work. It will be okay. I'll just get some kitchen paper in a minute. No, things don't always go the way you want them to, but. They go differently. Count to ten. <laughs> but this is how ideas are born. Do you know sometimes things go differently? reacting with the ink a wee bit but that's fine we'll just get a few finer splatters on maybe 
tidy up Janice. Right, just so you know, it does react with the colour, the shimmer paint, more than your ink, your white ink would because it's a different consistency, but it's left me. I've run away and left me, so I can't do anything about it. I'm just going to just touch up this bit here, though. Okay, so it's not quite what I had in mind when I set out, but hey, well, it will recover. Right, so where did I put this? I guess that's going lower down to hide some of that <laughs> Yeah, I was thinking, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't even know where my white ink pad is, that's an issue. Oh no, there it is. Yeah, there's enough, but you have to be careful because this takes a wee while to dry. Does give it a bit of texture though. Okay, Sylvia. Enjoy. Is that a face to face class you've got where you actually meet up with real people? Because that would be something, wouldn't it? This could be messy because the craft white will still be wet. I'm just going to move this before I end up putting my... And I bet you as soon as I tidy this up, I will find my white re-inkers. I I, I'll, I'll do have two of them. Wash my hands. I started off doing clean and simple. It just went a bit horribly wrong there. <laughs> I don't think it's horrible, I think it's fine, but I need to just, there's splatters everywhere. Let's just... I think I'm needing it, my wink of stylus are all a bit on the dry side as well. Everything's collapsing on my desk. So I'm... Um, just need um, some dragonflies to finish this off. I'm just going to ignore this bit at the bottom. It's not really there. Um, might as well use the edge of this for my dragonfly one. It was a learning opportunity. And an, a lesson for someone who's not keeping things tidy, maybe. <laughs> a lesson for the disorganised crafter. Crafting on the hoof is a bit dangerous sometimes. Right, so which glue? I've got about five bottles of glue lying here as well. I'm going to stick these on and then paint them with a bit of wink. I might, yeah, maybe just will. Then it looks like it's there on purpose, doesn't it? 
Yeah, we've got we've got hundreds of we can make as many of these dragonflies as we want. We can have a swarm of them. Well, I'm going to say something a bit rude, but I can't help myself. It looks like that one weed on the card. Now I've lost my tweezers. <laughs> Suzanne, can you see my tweezers? Got them. I've gotten quiet as I'm concentrating on my dragonflies. Which on the edge of the cardstock with the sentiment on, I'm not sure. I'm not with you, Nessa. I've been a bit slow in the uptake, I think. I'm going to have another one. And I don't do even numbers, so... And then we'll pop a bit of bling on. Wink a style and some bling and this will be what was to be a simple card, a very over the top card. <gasps> Come stay still. That's... Right, and then some Wink of Stella. I just don't think there's enough in this to have done the splatters with, but perhaps it would have been a better way. Come on. I'm, need, I'm needing a new one, but I'm needing to use up what I've got as well. Do you know that? Three bits of a wink. If I find a wink that's working better, I'll put more on later. But it is sparkling them up and making them pretty. Like me fireflies.
Okay, I'm just going to stop. Stop, stop, stop. So there we are. Late night crafting. I think I rescued it. What do you think? Which one do you like best? Which do you like best, one or two? Is that a bit of a delay tonight? Suzanne, you're liking one, yeah. That, this was the one that I was starting off. That This was the one that was in my head. And then I thought, well, when you cut the flower out, you might as well use it for something else. Yeah, so I'm quite happy with that. I did say I would like you see these dies. So the Dandy Wishes dies. So this one here... You can make a 3D flower. I must have a go because you've got one, one, two, three more layers that you can add up and texture it up with the lovely petals. And then it's got like a wee, I don't know what you call that, like, that, that, that can go at the back of the dragonfly. <laughs> so you could put texture on your card. Um, you've got a bit of gra like long grass here that cut out and then these shapes stamp cut out the stamps that are in the stamp set which appears not to be on my shelf at the moment where it should be so I can't show you it. Yeah well it's disappeared. I don't know. But anyway I thought the dies were fun as well. I like the stamp set but the dies are great fun. I really don't know where it, that stamp set is. I really don't know where anything is. Do you know when you're supposed to be going to bed, perhaps that's what you should do. But anyway, it'll turn up. It's around somewhere. I, I need to tidy up. That's the issue. And well, what happens is I come to tidy up and I craft. So there you have it anyway. Two cards for the price of one. So anyway, whatever you're doing, I hope you enjoy. I'm going to head to bed. Well, I've finished tidying up, I think. I'll, now, I won't sleep because I don't know where my white reinker is. So I need to find that. And I'm sure if I just tidy up, it'll appear. And then I'll be cross. Hey, no point. It worked out. So thanks, everybody. Have a lovely day, night, afternoon, evening, whatever you've got in front of you. Um, yeah, some of you are on Sunday already. Sleep well, everybody. And we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe and um, get like, leave nice comments. I love all your comments. Tomorrow's Sunday morning. I'll be sitting having my coffee and answering all my comments. So it'll be nice to hear what you think. And yeah, just take care, everybody. <laughs> Bye. Good night. I can't find the button to get out. <laughs> Where's the door? I need to, I need a f Frank get here. Frank get the door.